Oh, it's that time once again, baby. Here are 50 amazing facts to blow your mind. The king cobra is not a cobra. It's actually the sole species of its genus and just happens to look a lot like a cobra. During World War II, something occurred called the Yellow River Break, where China destroyed their own dams and levees in a tragic attempt to create defensive water blockades. This intentional effort to thwart enemy advances led to the drowning deaths and loss otherwise of 400,000 to 500 100,000 Chinese civilian lives. Former Washington Commander's owner Dan Snyder owned Six Flags and he ended up sending it into bankruptcy. Before whistles were introduced, hockey referees used a cowbell. They had to switch to whistles when fans started bringing their own cowbells to disrupt gameplay. A man in the Middle Ages wrote a book claiming that witches were stealing men's, uh, members, putting them in a nest, feeding them oats, and keeping them as pets. He was in part responsible for starting the European witch trials. In 1862, John Langdon Down was the first to describe a distinct mental disability, calling it Mongolism due to his perception that children with it shared facial similarities. Now understood to be Down syndrome, it was discovered in the 1950s to be caused by the presence of a third copy of chromosome 21. Keanu Reeves has a group of fungus compounds named after him. This is because scientists who isolated the compound group described their deadliness towards mold as being comparable to the deadliness of Reeves' movie roles. An aluminum-based Airstream was the only travel trailer in America to survive the Great Depression. While cleaning up the World Trade Centers in the early 2000s, crews found a shipwreck seven feet below the foundation that dated all the way back to 1773. Exploding head syndrome causes patients to hear a loud, frightening noise when falling asleep or waking up. Up to 10% of people may have it, but cases often go undiagnosed. When the Apollo astronauts were out of radio contact with the ground, they actually had a tape recorder inside their spacecraft that recorded their private, unguarded conversations. These transcripts were classified until the 1970s because they included detailed information about Apollo operations. Despite not having played since 2018, MLB player Andrew Tolles has remained under contract with the Los Angeles Dodgers so that he can continue receiving mental health treatment for his schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. More than 1,600 people are recorded to have died from falling off the Great Pyramids of Giza in the last 200 years. The vehicles in Disneyland's Indiana Jones ride cannot reverse. The final boulder escape scene is achieved by tilting the vehicle's motion base backwards and accelerating the walls past the riders. Squirrel's terminal velocity is so low that they can fall from any height and actually survive. Saint Claire of Assisi, who died in the year 1253, is the patron saint of television. This is because when she was too ill to attend mass, she had reportedly been able to see and hear it on the wall of her room. Julia Louis Dreyfus, who you probably know best as Elaine from Seinfeld, is the actress with the most primetime Emmy Awards and Screen Actors Guild Awards. Treadmills were originally used as punishment devices for people sentenced to forced labor in British prisons. It was banned as cruel and inhumane by 1900. So if you hate your cardio machine, you're not alone. In 1991, the Brian Adams song, Everything I Do, which has reached number one worldwide, was declared not to be sufficiently Canadian enough by the regulatory body CRTC, denying it more frequent airplay in Canada. This, despite Adams being made a member of the Order of Canada in 1990. Well, that's our country for you. Spelling bees, the competitions where competitors must correctly spell words until one is left standing, doesn't really exist outside of English and is almost exclusively an American thing. Yeah, that's true. I don't remember ever having a spelling bee in Canada. That's weird. <gasps> Over 60 towns were scouted as possible shoot locations for the movie Groundhog Day. Though relatively remote, it was felt that Woodstock, Illinois offered the timeless quality that the filmmakers sought. The town even came with a large pothole for Phil or Bill Murray to step in. According to the information from the California-based Wine Institute, tiny Vatican City consumes more wine per capita than any other country. Craigslist generates over $600 million in revenue annually with 
only 50 employees. I am in the wrong business. Several studies have proven that heterosexual men act differently around women, but in unexpected ways. For example, they're more likely to jaywalk, wait until the last second to dash onto a bus, take more risks while gambling, volunteer and donate more, etc. The effects are strongest in single young men. The eternal flame at the JFK Memorial was accidentally doused 15 days after it was lit in 1963 by kids pouring holy water on it. It was extinguished one other time in 1967 when the transformer powering the spark igniter was flooded and shorted out during a rainstorm. Nobody thought to waterproof that, huh? Okay. The reason why a lot of animal shelters are full of huskies is because of the TV show Game of Thrones. Everybody wanted their own real-life direwolf, but then abandoned them after they realized how much work they are. There are plastic-eating bacteria that can turn trash into silk. Scientists turn to bacteria that are naturally able to consume polyethylene. They then genetically edited the microbes so that they could also produce a silk-like material. Mike Tyson went bankrupt in 2003. This, despite having earned $400 million from Boston, Boxing, and examples of reckless spending include $6.3 million on luxury cars and $580,000 on his 30th birthday. He's improved his financial situation and now receives over $900,000 a month from his various business ventures. Babe Ruth constantly cheated on his wives during his baseball career. A detective that the New York Yankees hired to follow him one night in Chicago reported that Ruth had been with six women. Another player said that he was not Ruth's roommate when traveling because I room with his suitcase. In Kenya, a man once assumed the identity of a lawyer named Brian Mwenda and won dozens of lawsuits despite being not trained at all. Just like the show Suits. However, he was eventually arrested for identity theft after his deception was uncovered. Muhammad Ali's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame is on a wall instead of on the ground. This is because Ali, a devout Muslim, did not want people stepping on the name Muhammad. War pigs were used by the Romans because the squeals would scare war elephants into fleeing and cause them to trample their own armies. Wee, wee. It takes sloths a whole month to digest a single leaf and they only poop once a week. That's a real slow poopy. <laughs> Octopuses deliberately throw shells at each other. Researchers found that 66% of throws were made by females, often in response to mating attempts. Keep in mind, for a creature with no thumbs or rotator cuffs, they had a 17% hit rate. Voltaire was known to drink up to 40 cups of coffee a day at a cafe in Paris. He would drink his coffee mixed with chocolate. The oldest humanoid archeological find in Japan dates back 22,000 years ago. It contained the fossils of two males and three to seven females. It's believed that they were speared, eaten, and then thrown into the fissure. The airport in Stockton, California once tried to rename itself San Francisco Stockton Regional Airport despite being 83 miles from San Francisco. Scotland was once home to two foot long scorpions. Acetaminophen or Tylenol toxicity is the second most common cause of liver transplantation worldwide and the most common cause of liver transplantation in the United States. It's responsible for 56,000 emergency departments visits, 2,600 hospitalizations, and 500 deaths per year in the United States. Schizophrenic hallucinations vary across culture, Western illusions being more violent and harmful. The US government incurs a yearly loss of $110 million from minting pennies. They're also one of the only governments left in the developed world to do so. Here in Canada, we got rid of our pennies long ago, and every transaction is just rounded up or down. Because tungsten and gold have almost identical weights, fake gold bars and coins made from tungsten cannot be identified by the usual method of density testing. Instead, an ultrasound has to be used. Lamarcus Thompson, the father of the American roller coaster, invented the first coasters on Coney Island because he thought the world was too sinful and needed more moral entertainment. I personally hate roller coasters. Just made from the devil. A man in California named Gary Brooks Faulkner tried to hunt Osama bin Laden with a katana and night vision goggles. In 1993, James Scott purposely damaged a levee and caused a massive flood of the Mississippi River only to stall his wife from coming home so that he could party. Seems like a reasonable thing to do.
Some states in India pay policemen to keep mustaches to appear more intimidating. 14 artists lent their voices as backup vocals to the song All of the Lights by Kanye West. There is no laundry facility on the International Space Station. Astronauts typically wear their clothes until they're too dirty and then discard them. These clothes are placed in a cargo ship that will eventually burn up upon re-entering Earth's atmosphere. The 5-0 in the title of the 1960s TV series Hawaii 5-0 refers to Hawaii being the 50th U.S. state. Cardiovascular disease is strongly correlated with a specific type of earlobe crease. This crease between the tragus and outer edge of the earlobe is called the Frank sign. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Here's the outro card. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this, please share it and leave a like. Both help me out a lot. And of course, an extra special thank you to my channel members who get exclusive access to the bloopers from this video, which is one of the clickable links on screen right now. I'll see you guys next time. Much love.